Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you the demo of our latest appointment booking bot using WhatsApp flows within Watermate platform. If you're a business that sells services and are looking to sell it seamlessly on WhatsApp, we put the right solution for you. And I'm going to be showing you a demo of how easy it is to set up an appointment booking bot on Watermate platform and how your customers or prospects interact with the bot on WhatsApp as well. Let's dive into the demo. In order to install the appointment booking bot, all you have to do is once you log into Watermate platform, go to automations menu option under communications, click on it and um, under WhatsApp, just check if you already have any existing bot installed. If you have that, uh, just select all and delete them um, and you can install the bot by clicking on add rule button. We do offer a bunch of chatbot templates for you to get started with and one of the template is flow based appointment chatbot version 2. WhatsApp. This is the one that we will be installing. I'm going to click on install rule to install the bot. Uh, it'll take a couple of seconds behind the scenes. Um, actually, we create WhatsApp flow um, and link it to our platform and the bot and it all seamlessly link together behind the scenes for you. And there you go. It's installed already. Uh, with this in place, your bot is actually installed and ready to be tested. Now that we have install the bot on our staging environment let's just test it out to see how it works from an end user point of view i am going to be messaging hi to my staging number this should actually have the bot replying to me and it presents me with the menu option with all of these menu options obviously this is um, the template that we offer for all of our customers to get started um, uh, straight away but obviously if you want to customize all of these options we do um, help with that and at the same time if you want to set up a bot that's completely not in English um, in other languages we do help our customers set up that kind of bot as well so I'm going to be selecting book an appointment which is the most important thing to show the flow based bot as such and this should actually reply me with a button that opens up the flow within the chat window itself so if I click on it rather than a user having to answer one by one uh, each questions to be able to go through the appointment booking flow it just makes it easier for them to select all of these options within the chat window on um, a form like option within whatsapp itself so i've got several different options several different steps like category service staff date and time um, these are the steps required to complete the appointment booking obviously if you want to take out um, some of these steps if you want to customize we can help with that as well but these are the default options available so let's say if I um, select the category, um, if you have multiple categories, it just helps you filter out the services, especially when you have a large number of services, you can put out categories for end user to um, easily navigate through services as such. Um, so here we can see a whole bunch of services. Um, what I'm really going to select is service via API. Um, and then it opens up um, the staffs option. So if I click on staff, it just shows um, the staffs that actually offer that particular service within the business as such. So I'm going to be selecting Babu. And um, one of the cool things that we have done is, especially um, if a business is um, uh, operating globally and they do have customers across multiple time zones, it's important for you to um, get the time zone of the client so that there are no confusions with the time slots as such. Uh, by default, we show the time zone of the operating business, but at the same time, if the end user wants to look at the time slots in a different time zone, they can quickly go and change the time zone or if they wish to proceed with um, the same time zone as such they can leave it blank um, this is something that is available in the default template but at the same time if you want to remove it since you are operating within the same time zone we can help you remove that all of those options are possible as well so I'm going to be selecting a date um, here I am presented with uh, the day of the week as well it just makes it easier because people want to book an appointment on one day or Tuesday or Wednesday that's how people think um, and having a calendar would not make it easier because WhatsApp calendar doesn't show you um, the day of the week as well. So I'm going to be selecting the time slots so it just presents me with all the time slots uh, based on the availability of the staff um, so I am happy with all of these options so I'm going to click on continue. The next option is obviously we want to collect the personal details of um, the customer that is making the booking. Um, we do have um, an option for them to choose if they are an existing customer on the given number that they are messaging from. If they have registered customers within the business, um, you can see that uh, list here. Um, you may see a lot of customers uh, in my staging environment because I've been testing 
create a lot of customer records as well. So I can simply select an existing customer or the other option is if I scroll down, I should also see register customer. Um, in real life scenario where it's helpful is, um, let's say if uh, I am looking for my kids or my parents or grandparents, those kind of things, I have um, the option to register multiple customers as well. Or if I'm a new customer, all that I would see is just the register customer. And as soon as I select that, I'm presented with name, phone and email um, where I can fill it up to register a new customer or I can just simply select this one. And we do have notes as well. So simply I'm gonna select notes and then click on continue. Um, it will present me with a summary, uh, just confirming with the user this is what they're going with. And also it has terms that they have to agree with. Um, so you can click on it to see the terms. And these are terms that we have set up um, by default. But obviously if you wanna customize these terms because you have specific cancellation policies in place and things like that, we can help you update that as well. So I'm gonna go back and click on, I agree to the terms and I'm gonna click on confirm appointment. As soon as I click on confirm appointment, um, the uh, platform has actually sent the booking request and it had actually made the booking as well and it had sent me a confirmation messages. And beyond this, um, you can set up reminders to be sent to the customer, you know, uh, depending on your preference, whether one hour before the session or one day before the session, all of those options are easily available for you to set up within automate platform as such. That's it guys. We have made it so simple for businesses to get started with our appointment booking solution. Um, if you are interested to learn more about our platform or more about our solution, subscribe to our channel. We'll be posting a lot of uh, videos. And if you want to sign up for a free trial, we do have a seven day free trial. The link is in the description. Um, just sign up and try out our board. And if you like it, you can subscribe to our platform as well. Um, and if you want to talk to us, you can reach out to us and we'll be more than happy to jump on a call and do a demo or discuss more about your use case as well. Thank you.